All right, what's up guys? So today we are gonna be showcasing what is, in my opinion, one of the most impressive combos in the entire game, especially considering how easy they are to get. You know, like if we were talking about two summonable LRs or two Dokkan Fest units, that's a completely different story because that's gonna be much less accessible to the average player. But these two units, are super old, they're extremely common, I'm pretty sure they've been offered for free multiple times in the Baba shop as well through those thank you gift cards or wish strips, so most people should have them. And now with their Extreme Z Awakenings, they are absolute monsters man. And of course I'm talking about the AGL Kid Goten and the Fizz uh, Kid Trunks. Now before we get into the showcase, before we jump into the gameplay, I want to quickly go over the details for both these units, so if you guys already know what they do, then feel free to skip ahead about a minute to a minute and a half. Alright, so starting with the Trunks here, his leader skill is Fizz Types key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 100%, super attack, supreme damage, and raises attack and defense for 6 turns, and passive is attack and defense plus 100% at the start of the turn, plus an additional attack plus 100%, when performing a super attack, and chance of performing a critical hit plus 18% reduces damage received by 18% and all allies attack and defense plus 18% when there's an ally whose name includes Goten Kid attacking on the same turn or when Krillin or Android 18 is on the team. And uh, as far as links go, Golden Warrior, Royal Lineage, Super Saiyan, The Innocent, Budding Warrior, Prepare for Battle, and Shattering the Limit, you might notice that all the links are at level 1, so keep that in mind as we go through the video. They both could be, you know, quite a bit more powerful if they were maxed out, obviously. And then for the Goten, very, very similar, okay? Very similar details. Leader skill is AGL types, key plus 3, HP attack and defense plus 100%, super attack, supreme damage, and raises attack and defense for 6 turns. And then passive is attack and defense plus 100% at the start of the turn, plus an additional attack plus 100%. When performing a super attack, chance of performing a critical hit plus 18%, reduces damage received by 18% and all allies attack and defense plus 18% when there is an ally whose name includes uh, Trunks Kid attacking in the same turn, or when Krillin or Android 18 is on the team. Links are Golden Warrior, Kamehameha, Super Saiyan, Innocent, Spudding Warrior, Prepare for Battle, and Shattering the Limit. So there you go, that is everything you need to know about these kids, we are on the hybrid Saiyan stage of Super Battle Road because I feel like they do really, really well here. So we got them together. We don't have any support here. And they're starting off with 124,000 defense and 113,000 defense, respectively. Of course, they haven't supered yet. They haven't attacked yet. So they haven't had a chance to build the attack and defense as well. And um, I think what we're going to do is actually just no item at this turn i'm a little bit worried if we get like super three times we're probably dead but otherwise we should be okay we'll see it's gonna be a test so here we go no item on the first turn we're just gonna go for a type advantage here and hold on um i can give these to trunks and then we should be able to get a super off with gohan as well uh let's go for fasha here okay here we go, let's see what happens. Turn one, super battle road. Getting supered immediately. And getting supered again, okay. You know, that's not too bad. <laughs> that's not too bad considering it's super battle road. And you guys can see the damage. It is significant. It is very significant. 3.3 to 3.6 and then trunks with uh, I think 3.3 as well. And even though we got super twice, we are still looking pretty good for HP. Um, all things considered, man, that's actually pretty crazy. That, that's actually pretty crazy. I was expecting to take at least 100k. Um, but to take only 70k before we had a chance to even build our defense, right, is, uh, is quite good. I would say that's quite good. Okay, so for this off rotation, I think what I'm going to do is... Probably keep these two to mm, actually doesn't matter too much. I do want the support. Um, 
of one of them, so we'll definitely leave one of them out, like one of the 40% supports, but let's let's do it like this. We got a decent amount of defense for Gohan, he should be okay. And uh, yeah, we'll go for Bardock here. And then, actually let's keep going for Bardock just in case he doesn't die. And we should be getting through this one pretty quick. But as you guys can see, on turn one, both the Goten and the Trunks got over 3 million easily. Level one links across the board, right? So it could be, you know, quite a bit higher than that if we had been able to get their links higher, which I, I you know, I could have done before the video, but I was a little lazy, not gonna lie. Oh, okay, so I didn't expect to kill both of them. That's a lot unfortunate because <laughs> I kind of want to at least get each, um, you know, of the kids, the Goten and the Trunks to attack like multiple times within a stage, but it might be a little bit hard to do that. We'll see. We'll see. Okay. So second phase here, um, I think I'm actually going to put go or no, uh, Trunks in the front just because there's a lot of tech attacks there. Starting off with 128,000 defense, which is decent. And uh, let's go for Vegeta here, obviously, with the type of advantage. And let's just kill Vegeta first. We'll kill Vegeta first. Okay, so I'm not going to use an item once again. Because uh, last time, we got the double super, and it was okay. Now, we're taking 42 for a normal. We're taking a super here for 21k. All right. <laughs> That's... um. That, that's pretty good. And then we got 3.7 mil for the attack stat. And Vegeta is half dead. And then now we have Goten getting 3.8 mil. Additional normal there. And uh, Vegeta still alive, but barely. So our Gohan should be able to finish him off. But yeah, guys. I mean, you can pretty much see what I'm talking about, right? Like, these kids are so good, man. They're so good. And when I say... You know, when I say, like, impressive combination, I don't mean, you know, like, they're the hardest hitting combo duo in the game, because obviously, there are a bunch of duos in this game that hit um, equally, if not more hard, right? But it's the fact that they are such common units, right? Like, they've been around forever, and um, for them to get Extreme Z Awakenings like this, for them to hit numbers that they're hitting, along with the defense, Right? It's not just about the attack, it's the attack and defense together that kind of took me by surprise. Um, so, yeah, I'm extremely happy with these two. And as you can see, man, Super Battle Road is not really much of a challenge. Uh, if it was Extreme Super Battle Road, it definitely would be a different story. I mean, they could still hold their own, don't get me wrong. It's just, we would have to be a little bit more careful. But it kind of looks like we can no item this stage now with this team we have here, which is going to be nice. Um, okay, Gohan needs to stop additional attacking so much because we don't really need to see him in action. We already know what he can do. Let's give the limelight to the kids here for a second. Um, okay, so we're looking at 218,000 defense and 199,000 defense respectively for Goten and Trunks. And let's see what kind of damage we can do now after one super with the trunks supporting as well for 40%. Yeah, there we go. 4.29 mil is the attack stat. We should kill him. Oh, we did it. We did it. That's that's fine. That's fine. Let's see what let's see what trunks does now. 4.25. Yeah. Yeah. They are pretty good. Nah, they're insane. They are insane. Holy crap. Alright, um, this phase got me a little bit worried. If I'm being honest, uh, I know how hard they hit, so I'm slightly concerned. Uh, we should still be okay, realistically. I'm gonna actually put the Gohan there. Well, they're both Gohan, actually. Um, I'm gonna put the STR Gohan. Let's, um... I guess we'll go for Paragus first, because he definitely has less HP. And, uh... I'm still not gonna item. I'm still not gonna item. It, it, it should be, it should be okay. 
Yeah, there we go. 10 damage. 112. It's getting supered for 10k. Okay. <laughs> yeah, no item necessary. I, I don't even know why I was concerned in the first place. But I remember, like, these stages still hit pretty hard if I... If I'm not mistaken, like even the regular category super battle with stages still do a decent amount of damage. So the fact that we're probably going to no item this year is actually a bit surprising to me. It's actually a little bit surprising, but that's fine. It just kind of goes to show like how far units in this game have come, you know, like how much power creep has really played a role in, uh, you know, in the recent releases. Okay, let's see, um, yeah, we're gonna leave Goten in the front. Um, I'm a little bit concerned for him, but uh, I, 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 I have faith, I believe, so hopefully Broly doesn't super us immediately. Oh, there he goes. Okay, Broly supering us, so we're gonna take 140k, alright, alright, I mean, as I said, they still hit hard, so it's not really a surprise. And now we're going to get Super by Paragus, 70k that time. Okay, so it went from 140k from Broly to 70k from Paragus. Of course, after the first Super, we did, you know, build up some defense. So, um, that Super, that second Super definitely didn't hurt nearly as much as the first one. Yeah, we're not going to item. Screw that. No items necessary. Like, it, <laughs> even though we're kind of close to death. We should be able to weather the storm here, especially if we get a stun off with uh, Trunks next turn. Which we probably will be able to. We pro or actually, both these guys can stun. So this guy can stun, this guy can stun, so... Um, yeah, let's see how it goes. So, let me... Let me put Gohan there. And... I guess we can't really get a partner super attack or unit super attack, so... For a second, I was like, can we get that? But we have to, we need a youth Gohan, I believe. So, yeah, anyways, let's see if we can get the stun here. If we get the stun here, it's over. If we don't get the stun, it's probably still over, anyways. But I would feel a lot better if we got the stun right now with Trunks. So, oh, additional. Okay, come on. Second chance. Okay, still no stun. That's fine. That's fine. We still got this. Um, I'm probably going to end up putting... Probably going to still put Goten in front because he's going to have a little bit more defense. And then... Uh, oh, oh, look at that. We took 49 damage for that super. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Yeah, so 218,000 defense. 199k for Trunks. And uh, this is going to be a wrap, guys. Let me see if we can actually get a token attack. I think we can for Goten. There we go. Okay, so Goten, go, go. I was, I was gonna say Goten attack. It is a Goten attack, but it's a Goten Doken attack. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. Hopefully that's enough to get Broly out of here. But if it's not, then Trunks will definitely finish the job. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, okay, that was enough. <laughs> there you have it, guys. Go Ted and Trunks. Crazy, crazy combo. One of the best in the game. One of my favorites in the game by far. And uh, most people, if you've, been playing, if you've been playing for any period of time, you know, like at least a year or so, should have these two lying in your box if you haven't already Extreme Z Awakened them. So do yourself a favor. Extreme Z Awaken them. Do the Extreme Z Battle event. It's very easy, by the way. Like... You know, it's probably one of the easiest ones we've had so far, at least recently. And uh, get it done, Extreme Z Awaken these two. Obviously, Easy A the 18 too, show her some respect. But yeah, the combo of these two is just, it's awesome. It really is, man. They, they are so, so good. So uh, that's the video. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about them. And uh, I'll probably get to work, you know, leveling up their links. Because I think they deserve to at least have like level 5 plus links instead of level 1 across the board. And um, yeah, that's it guys. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And 
If it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.